In this video we will get 1-4-ethoxyphenyl urea or dulcin. Dulcin was discovered by the chemist Joseph Berlinerblau in the year 1883 and is 250 times sweeter than sugar. In the early 20th century, dulcin was more widely used than saccharine as it did not have such a bitter taste. In the year 1954, Dulcin was withdrawn from the market after proving toxic in animal tests and is now considered a toxic substance. In Japan there have been many poisoning by Dulcina and it was banned in the year 1969. To synthesize the Dulcin, we will hydrolyze the phenacetine by heating it with hydrochloric acid to form paradithoxyanaline hydrochloride. Hydrochloride responds with urea and acetic acid to form dulcin. For this operation, we will put 1.8 grams of phenacetine into a 50 milliliters flask with three necks. We added a 5 milliliters solution of hydrochloric acid concentrated in 10 milliliters of water and heated under reflux with agitation until total dissolution of the solid. Let cool a little and add small portions of sodium hydrogen carbonate until you reach a pH between 6 and 6.5. When this pH level is reached, we add 2.5 grams of urea and 3 drops of acetic acid. Heat in reflux over an hour. It is left to cool and a white mass of dulcin emerges. Collect the solid by suction. Wash several times with cold water. Dissolve the solid in 100 milliliters boiling water and filter well hot. Concentrate the solution at 50 milliliters and let cool in the refrigerator. Call at the crystals by suction. Wash in chilled water once. Dryer in the oven at 80 degrees. The dulcin is crystalline in thin white needles. We identify the melting point. The theoretical melting point of dulcin is 160 degrees and in our test it melted down to 152 and 158 degrees. If the melting point is lower than 150 degrees it is convenient to crystallize to purify. This melting point indicates contamination by phenacetin which has a melting point of 133 degrees. The yield of this synthesis was 56%. Do not ingest dulcin, poisoning hazard. 